Okay, today we're going to learn subtraction with regrouping. Just remember, we talked about yester yesterday that we are taking away from the total. Okay, and we always want to make sure that our bigger number on, is on top. 53 is a larger value than 29, so 53 is bigger. We're going to first start with drawing out our place value blocks. We are only going to draw 53 because that's the total. Then we're going to take 29 away from 53. Just like in addition, we're going to start in the ones column. Uh-oh, I need to take 9 from 3. But I don't have 9. So now, I'm going to regroup. I'm going to take a 10 and I'm going to put it in my ones column. And when I do that, I'm adding 10 ones. Since I changed my ones column here, I want to change my ones column in my problem. I took away a 10, so I'm going to get rid of that 5, and now I have 1, 2, 3, 4. Put the 4 on top of the 5, because now I have five, 4 10s left. I no longer have 3 ones. I have 3 plus 10 more. I have 13 tens. Now I can subtract. I'm going to take away 9. I'm going to cross them off. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I have 4 ones left. And I know that 13 minus 9 is 4. Now I'm going to go here and I see that I have 4 tens take away 2 tens. I have 4 tens. I'm going to take away 2. I get two tens left. My answer is 24. Let's try another one. Now I have six, 76 minus 38. Again, I'm going to draw my place value blocks. And again, I know that 76 is greater than 38. This is the total. I'm taking away 38 from the 76. I'm going to draw 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 tens, 6 ones. Now I need to take 8 ones from 6, but I can't because I only have 6. That's why I need to regroup. I'm going to take 10 and I'm going to put it over into the ones column. I'm trading that 10. I'm regrouping that 10 for 10 ones. Now I don't have six tens. Now I have six plus 10 which is 16. And I no longer have seven tens. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. You want to make sure that you're showing that in your problem. This is your regrouping. Now I can subtract 16 minus 8. I can cross off my 8. And I have left 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And I know that 16 minus 8 equals 8. Now I can go to my tens column and I have 6 minus 3. Take away those three tens, I'm left with 1, 2, 3. I was regrouping because I didn't have enough ten, enough ones here. So I was regrouping.
Next one that we're going to try is 74, which is our total, minus 48. We are taking 48 away from the 74. I'm going to draw my place value blocks. Seven tens, four ones. It says that I need to take eight ones away, but I don't have eight ones. I need to regroup. So I'm going to take a ten and I'm going to put it into the ones column. Now I have 14 ones. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Well, count that wrong. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. No, I didn't. I have 14. Now I can take 8 away. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And I have left one, two, three, four, five, six. And I know that 14 minus 8 equals 6. Do I still have seven tens? No. I only have one, two, three, four, five, six. And when I subtract two, I end up with one, two, three, four. My answer is 46. Now you try. Remember, draw your place value blocks. And if you don't have enough ones, then you're going to regroup your tens. And make sure that you're showing you're regrouping. Give it a try.